I think the players invested in the local community incredibly well. Uh, going down and playing tag rugby with, uh, with the locals from the school and you actively encourage it by putting them in situations where they're going to understand a little bit more about the world and about um, what the world means for other people. It's incredible what, what the guys here are doing. Um, started in Kenya and they're working all the way down to Cape Town, spending a week or two in each location, then leaving behind uh, a rugby school that can continue after they go and then they go through it all again next year. Hats off to them how quickly they manage it in each location and, and what they leave behind um, is really remarkable. Um, it's great to come out here and see um, how much they enjoy it and just how much they enjoy the game and, and what they can learn from us and what we can learn from them. Enjoyment. You know? <laughs> <laughs> and nobody was sighted. And nobody was sighted in today's match. <laughs> They, um, they allow people to grow as individuals, not just because you can't just say a person is a rugby player and that's all. I'm here with Kamani and he's man in the match today. How do you feel, Matt Kamani? Feel better. How many tries did you score? Five. Five tries? And that's why he was man in the match today. And how did it feel to lose with Joe? Yeah. Uh, better, better. I know, I know. It feels tough. It feels tough. We were, he was on my team. We won today. So you want to congratulate him? Congratulate him? Brilliant. Oh, man, you're man of the match today. Brilliant.